your mushroom farm these days requires online access for multiple different reasons. If you're trying to monitor humidity, camera capture pinning, or tweak climate controls without trekking through the mud or up a huge steep mountain like in my case, in the next few minutes, I'll show you how to simple point-to-point -point Wi Fi can turn your remote growing shed or building into a connected, data driven operation. What's up, Mushroom Fam? It's Gary with Fresh from the Farm Fungi. I'm here in Sedalia, Colorado, and today I'm going to talk about an important subject that you don't really realize until you don't have it anymore. That is internet and Wi-Fi capabilities on your mushroom farm. A little backstory is when we relocated to this facility a couple years ago, we did not have Wi-Fi that could transfer through the, the trees and through this metal building that I'm in. So about a year ago, a man reached out to me with a solution and I absolutely love it. And I wanted to do a video about the wireless bridge, which can extend Wi-Fi up to 3.1 miles. If you want to see our farm tour from a couple years ago, you'll notice that we just installed our electric here in the building about two and a half years ago. Before that, I was operating with batteries. Mostly everything was battery powered. And I had a couple extension cords that were online for um, some of the equipment that is pretty energy intensive. After that, we finally got electricity. However, there's no internet connection down here in my building. So as a solution, I got one of these wireless bridges, which essentially plugs into your existing internet, transfers it into a uh, signal where there's a receiving bridge connector and it transfers that signal into another wi wireless router, which gives me high speed internet. So this is extremely important for doing live streams, taking time-lapse videos. If you wanna adjust your environment or most importantly, in my opinion, for monitoring your cold storage. So we have our Coolbot trailer down here and especially in the summer, it's important to know that those mushrooms are staying cool. So we have a Wi-Fi powered uh, cool bot, which informs us if a temperature goes out of range, it will automatically text me. So that was an important reason why we needed internet down here. If I go ahead and unbox everything that comes in this package, you'll see that there's two bridges that connect into your routers. There's mounting hardware, and there's all the uh, cords that are required to connect the device to your router. What I did first was I attached the antennas, to, one to my house and one to the building. I made sure they were pointing at each other and the distance is about 350 feet. There's a few pine trees that are in the way, but it doesn't affect the connection at all. So what I did was I connected one of the antennas to our router that we already have at the house. And I made sure that it was on the same channel as the receiving receptor down on the building. So the box came with some mounting hardware. I used magnets on the building just so I didn't have to drill into the metal. And that would make it more adjustable if you know, they got knocked out from the weather or something weird happens and they need to be replaced. So the magnets hold them firmly and I haven't had any issues. And basically I hooked up the receiving end to my router down here in the building. And that provides high speed internet for the, the uh, complete farm and a little bit outside the farm as well. So this is going to allow me to do more live streams in the future, which I'm very excited about. And it also helps to monitor my cold storage cool bot where my mushrooms and most precious cargo are being stored. The setup was super easy. You just have to, and 
if you ever do any troubleshooting, all you have to do is unplug them and plug them back in and that usually fixes the problem. If you'd like more information about this product, the link is in the description below. I hope you enjoyed this video and if anyone is looking for a solution, these things can work up to three miles away. They're very good and you know, I did multiple speed tests and we're getting really high quality internet with this wireless bridge. Okay, thanks for watching. Until next time, much love.